Sean Strickland calls out Paulo Costa. Is this a fight that could happen? I'll tell you in just one second here. My name is James Lynch. Make sure you hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. Those three things really do help out this channel a lot. Okay, let's get into it. Sean Strickland on Instagram calling out Paulo Costa in a pretty uh, funny video. Hopefully YouTube doesn't kick me off for the music in the background, but we'll see what they say. I'm just out here with my boy Marvin Vittori. Looking all metrosexual like like he just walked out of Europe. All fighters dress like that, by the way. Out here with Johnny Parsons fighting diabetes and obesity. Yeah. He actually he has put on a lot of weight. I think Johnny Parsons is a bantamweight, is he not? Uh, but yeah, putting on the pounds a little bit, but uh, Strickland, a comedian as usual. Yo, let's see that belly. Strength coach. You're, you're representing the non binary kind of bullshit, huh? All right, hey, don't get me kicked off Instagram. He's right about Yo, that. Yo, Costa, I think we should fight, bro. It fucking makes sense, you know. I don't know if you're drunk, if you're going to be able to make weight, if you're eating cookies. Let's make this shit happen. Yeah, so uh, there you go. Sean Strickland uh, calling out uh, Paulo Costa at the UFC PI. I love the fight. I think it makes a lot of sense. I was actually just looking at the rankings, and you've got Paulo Costa at number six, Strickland at number seven. Of course, Costa was supposed to fight Robert Whitaker next month at uh, UFC 284. That is not happening. Um, yeah, sign me up. I would love to see that fight. Can you imagine the chaos leading up to Apollo Costa and Sean Strickland fight with how crazy both of these guys are? And the fight itself would be interesting, right? Costa, really good stand-up, really good pace. Same thing with Strickland. Obviously, Costa's got a bit more power. Could Costa knock out Strickland? I don't know. Very interesting to see if that would unfold. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm totally for this fight. I think it makes sense with the rankings. Um, I know maybe from Costa's perspective, going from a guy like Whitaker to Strickland is a bit of a step down. But at the same time, I think it makes a lot of sense. Now, will this fight actually happen? I'm saying no. Um, I think Paulo Costa's got some serious issues with the UFC and his contract. I don't think this is a fight that happens anytime soon. But again, all it takes is one phone call for the UFC to talk to Costa, figure out their contract, and figure out something that works for both sides. I don't know if they can do that because, again, you were given Robert Whitaker a very awesome opportunity. But maybe, you know, Costa looked at that fight as well and said, hey, look, I'm getting paid X amount. I have to fight Whitaker in Australia. Are you kidding me? Maybe there was, that was part of it too. So I'm not entirely sure. Um, I give this about a 50 50 chance of actually happening, but I think this is the type of fight that Sean Strickland should get. He's coming off that big win over Nasruddin Imovov, Costa coming off the win over Rockhold. It's a good sort of proving ground in that top five. I think it makes a lot of sense as far as the matchup. And if the fight was to take place, I might actually take Strickland here. I think he's been making a lot of good improvements. I think with Costa, if anything, I thought he actually didn't look that great in the Luke Rockhold fight. I thought that was a very uh, winnable fight in terms of him, and he did end up winning, but a, a very winnable fight in terms of getting a finish against Luke Rockhold, and that did not happen. I think Strickland, uh, I might give him the edge there so we'll see so uh, i want to know what you guys think in the comment section below do you like this fight for sean strickland what percentage do you think it will actually happen follow me on twitter and on instagram at lynch on sports make sure you subscribe to this youtube channel youtube.com slash lynch on sports and while you're there hit that like button hit that notification bell i'm james lynch thanks so much for watching and i'll see you next time